Good morning, everyone. Uh, I usually start my session with a small greeting song, which is from Jalebi Street. I know you must have heard it. And uh, people who are already into my sessions, they know it. So let's start the morning with greeting, the Indian style. Namaste, namaste, we join our hands and sing. Namaste, namaste, we bow our heads and say, Assalamu alaikum, the Khan family says, Varnakam, varnakam, in Tamil we sing, Sat Sri Akal, the big Punjabi hymn. Say hello in India, there are many ways. Yes? Yes, children, you agree, no? In India, we have so many ways to greet, correct? Yes. So, now, after a very good morning, let's start with our session. The name of our story. The title, yes? Do you want to know the title of the story? Yes, we all want to know. Little Preeti helps mom. Little Preeti helps mom. Okay, let's understand. Preeti is a school-going girl like you. You know what are her hobbies? Her hobbies are painting, cooking and singing. One morning, she was happily at on her study table drawing something as she was she used to like drawing she was drawing <laughs> what was she drawing she was drawing beautiful nature with green mountains Beautiful blue sky, birds, animals. You can see, no, the beautiful nature behind me. Animals, birds. So she was very fond of rivers. So she was drawing. <laughs> what did she doing? She was. Thinking. What was she thinking? Hmm. And then she got confused. Hmm. And you are thinking and you're confused. Where do you go? Yes. The first place where you go and ask your queries is Correct? Your mom. So, Preeti was also calling her mom. And how does mama reply to you all? Yes, Preeti. Dear, what is bothering you? Mom, there are beautiful sky. The resort on the water and boats. We also stay all over. But I was wondering, what is inside? What is inside the earth? Mama, please tell me now. What is inside? Now, I started thinking. What do you think? Mama has an answer? What do you think? Mama has an answer? Yes. Our mama has answers for everything. Now, Preeti's mama was thinking how to explain. Saying so, thinking so, she went to her favorite place in the house. Which is your mother's favorite place in the house? Yes. It's the... It's the... Kitchen. Correct. So, 
Preeti's mom also she went to the kitchen thinking how how will I explain the what is inside her to Preeti. Then suddenly mama got an idea. What was that idea? Let's hear. She calls her Preeti. Preeti. Yes mama. Hello. Today we are going to make some lovely veg koftas. Okay mama. And Preeti started thinking. You know why? What she was thinking? I asked mama what is inside the earth. But mama is asking me to make kofta. She wants me to help her. No matter. I will help her. Okay. Saying so, mama and Preeti started making koftas. Correct? You all know koftas? Vegetable koftas? Never mind. If you don't know, we will do it. We will also understand what is a veg kofta. Okay. We will also cook with Preeti and mom. So now what happened? First, they took boy potatoes and they started boiling it. The first step. Okay. Potatoes. They were boiling the potatoes. When the potatoes were boiling, what did they do the next step? They started grating the paneer. Yummy, yummy paneer. Okay. They grated the paneer and also cheese. The cheese which was there, they diced into a square piece. Okay. Then, till the time the paneer and the cubes were getting ready, the potatoes which had already boiled. So, mama put it for cooling. Yes, you require it to cool it down also, correct? Yes. So, mama start, uh, started to cool it. By the time the potatoes, the paneer and the cubes were like the potatoes were cooling and the things were getting ready, mama thought we will also make now the the entire, the entire uh, thing which is there, we need to assemble the paneer, the potato, the cubes. Yeah, it has to be assembled in the cover. Now we have to make the cover. So what will we use that cover? What ingredient mama is going to use? That is the basin flour or the gram flour. And then they made it into a liquid. Okay, they added some water. They added some salt and turmeric so that it is tasty okay if you don't add salt it will not be tasty no now the potato by this the potatoes had cooled down so mama pulled peeled the potatoes say she mixed it with paneer just mixing potato and paneer will it like will it taste good no no mama will add some magic mama magic what is that mama magic salt then turmeric, chili powder, chaat masala and then she makes it into a nice dumplings, round dumplings. And in the center of the dumplings, she slowly puts the cubes, the diced cheese cubes. Okay, now our dumplings are ready. Then what she does, she dips that dumplings into the basin batter which was there. And then, what does she do? She starts frying it. Correct? She starts frying it. Okay, now, the when the witch koftas are getting ready, when mama is make, frying the koftas, what do you think must have happened to Preeti? Preeti said, Mmm, your malicious kofta. Yamilicious kofta. Mm. So, what do you think? How did she understand? There was a nice aroma which was there. Because the koftas were frying, there was a nice aroma which was coming up. What do you think? Your first sense organ starts working there. The nose. The sense organ which starts working is the nose. That's how Preeti got the Aroma of the veg kofta. Then 
What was the next? Next was the next was the sight. She was seeing the koptas. So the second sense organ which was working was the eyes. Okay, she was now she is having the aroma. She is having the sight of the kofta. So the two sense organs are working. What do you think? Which will be the third sense organ to work? When your mama is cooking, you're getting nice aroma. You're able to see it. What will happen? The third sense organ, it is the mouth. The mouth starts drooling. And Preeti, she starts jumping. Jumping. Mama, mama, mama. I want to taste it. I want to taste it. I want to taste it. Must, what, what do you think? Mama must have said. Yes, Preeti. Be patient. Be patient. Let it cool down. Let the kofta cool down. Uh -huh. Mama, I can't wait. Mama, I can't wait. What do you think Mama must have done with the kofta? What does Mama do when something is very hot? Think. What does she do? She cuts the kofta into two pieces so that it cools down faster. Do you want to know how the kofta was looking like? The kofta was looking like this after frying. Wow! Now, mama has cut the kofta into two pieces to cool it down. Wow! What can you see? What can you see? There is molten cheese. Okay? Then, this is the paneer and the potato filling. And this is the basin crust. See how wonderful the kofta looks. And it was steaming hot. So all the heat was coming out. Now Preeti was enjoying the kofta. And Mama was explaining her about the kofta. What she was explaining. See there is a nice center. Okay. With cheese. And this is the filling. And this is the crust. She was eating and she was thinking. Why mama is explaining me the veg kofta so much? Yes, no, you also at times think, why mama, why? So she asked, mama, why are you explaining the kofta so much? Mama said, Preeti dear, my kofta is similar to earth. Earth. Yes. Now, how is kofta similar to earth? The first question should come to your mind. Why? Why is Preeti's mama saying that? Let's see. When we take the cross section of this kofta, of this earth, what happens? What do you think? Yes. Is it not like a kofta from inside? Like mama's kofta? Yes. The cheese. The cheese is the core, 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 which is molten. Half molten. It's half liquid, half solid. Okay. Then the paneer, potato filling is nothing but the mantle. And the basin crust is nothing but the crust on which we all stay. Correct. So, this is what well, this is exactly inside the earth. Mama explained Preeti. So, Mama said, whenever, whenever you want to remember what is inside the surface of the earth. So, please remember my humble kofta. My humble kofta. My kofta is similar to your earth's kral. Uh, earth surface, layers of the earth, which is core in between, followed by mantle and the crust. This is how Mama explained the layers of the earth to Preeti. And she was very, very happy to know what was inside the surface of the earth. Yes? Okay. 
Now you all must have understood what is the surf what is inside the surface of the earth. Okay. Now let's see whether we can draw something. Would you like to draw with me? Yes. Yes. We will try to draw. Okay. Um. Quickly, everyone, try and get the A4 sheet paper. Okay. And a small plate. Okay. A4 paper and a small plate. Okay. Please get a, uh, don't take a book. I said I want a paper, okay? We are drawing, we are doing something, an activity. So take a A4 size paper and a small plate. Yes, I give you two, two to three minutes. Pencil, you will require a pencil too. Coloring you can do later. Yes. Yes, ready everyone? Check the size of the plate. It should it should be smaller than your quarter plate, okay? A size smaller than your quarter plate. Yes, let's start. Okay. So this is the paper which is there. Okay. Fold it so that you get two equal pieces, two equal parts. Two equal parts. Okay, open it again. Okay, once done, now you have this, this midsection, correct? You have this midsection. Again, fold it into two parts. Similarly, here also you can fold it into two parts. Such a way that it forms like a small cupboard. You can open the doors, close the doors, correct? Kindly do the same. Yes, very good. Very good, Niaz. Yes, I can see that. Very good. Yes, Yasika is also doing. Arjun, have you completed it? Yes, but I can see you have completed it. Very good. Very good, Radhika. You have also done it. Very nice. Very nice. Okay. Once you have done this, take the plate. Okay. Place it and draw a circle on the top as well as inside. Okay. On the top as well as see the plate, the paper is like this. Draw it on the top as well as inside. Draw a circle. Oh, you have all completed it. Yes. Correct. Correct. We all we all together. Yes. Okay. Now, on this circle, we need to outside circle is our earth. Okay. So we are going to draw. Earth. What do you think is Earth? 
earth is earth comprises of the surface of the earth continents and ocean correct so we are going to show the same we can draw the outline and we can color it later okay just draw the outline you can use a pencil or you can use a color directly if you're confident Something like this. This part will be green. And this part will be blue. Okay? You can, maybe you can color it later too. I'm, do a, I'm doing a rough coloring. So that I can give you some time. Ring work should be like this. Okay? Okay? So you can color it like this. Okay. Once your earth is done inside, now you have to do inside work. What are you going to do? Now, listen to me carefully. You all know the alphabet C, correct? Alphabet C, correct? From this point, you start drawing an alphabet C till here. Okay? An inverted C from this side. Okay? So, you're going to draw two inverted C. Then, what is the next step? You're going to draw a straight line connecting the C. Done? Very good. Now, you're also going to do a double line here to the C as well as the straight line. Done. After that, you're going to do a, draw a small circle in between. So, the small circle which is inside is your crust. The layers which are there here, that's the core and the outside part is crust. You can again draw the earth which we had drawn, okay? We drew it earlier, the continents and the sea here also. So, your, your drawing should look like this. Your sketch should look like this, okay?
Okay, you all have seen? You know the colors? Okay. So now, whenever you want to remember what is there, layers of the, what is inside earth, what is inside earth? There is co crust, core, there, that is the core, the mantle and the crust. Correct? And what you will remember? The humble kofta. Correct? Yes, we all need to know this, that our humble kofta is similar to the layers of the earth. So it will be easier for you to recollect. Yes, you all have finished drawing. Were you able to draw with the simple tricks? Yes, very good. Yes, thank you, Niaz. Yasika, show me your drawing. Okay. Very good. Radhika, yes. Radhika, uh, can you just, uh, like your drawing is uh, like below. Can you hold it near the camera so that I can view it clearly? Radhika, can you hold it near the camera? A little up. Your drawing should be, yes, yes, yes. Yes. Very good. Very good. Very nice. Arjun, are you able to do it? Oh, he's coloring too. Very good. Can you show us the picture? Very nice. Outside, the earth's picture. Can you show me the first picture too? Yes, very good. Very nice. Good. Okay, okay. It's, it's been a wonderful workshop. Can you hear my voice? Yes. It's been a yes. wonderful workshop. Thank you very much to everybody. And now we'll, uh, in a minute, we'll we'll stop. Did uh, Miss Arti, did you want to say any uh, concluding words? Uh, yes. Thank you, uh, like all you beautiful people, young people for attending my session. Hope you have liked my session. You can find my de my details in... Uh, Indian Storytelling Network also. So all my details are available there. Thank you for attending my session. And thank you, Eric, for your support too. Thank you.